Let's take a self-signed certificate and make it so anyone who accesses the server that needs a certificate will automatically trust it so we don't get any kind of certificate errors. So we need to go to Tools and Group Policy Management. And we've relocated our certificate into the net logon folder because everybody can get to the certificate. So let's go ahead and minimize that. And now what we want to do is just create a brand new policy just because it's easier that way instead of editing the existing one and trying to hunt it down. And we'll just say work cert trust. You can call it anything you want. And we'll go ahead and click OK. And we're binding it to the root of our Active Directory domain because that way it will affect anybody who logs on. So there's our work cert trust. Right click, make sure it says it's enabled. If you choose enforced, that basically means that you cannot have it excluded in case someone has a, uh, a root that says to skip anybody else's certificates, which is called block inheritance. So even if block inheritance is on, then our new group policy will still work if we choose enforced. But we're not going to do that in this case. Let's just go ahead and click edit. And we're going to trust our certificate. So let's go to computer configuration. And from here, we're going to go to policies, Windows settings. And then we're going to go to security settings. And then we're going to go to our public key policies. From here, we're going to go to the trusted root certification authorities. And we're going to right click and we're going to choose Import. Click Next. We're going to browse to our file name. Next, put our password in. And we'll check the box that says Mark it as Exportable, because so we may want to do that in the future. And we're going to put this in our trusted root certification authority and click finish. And it was successful. So basically any user that tries to log in and needs to use the certificate will no longer get an error because it will be added into their trusted root.